Hey everybody, Joseph Simon with Bubbling Acres. Haven't been able to make a video in a little bit. Um, just had some crazy busy week and uh, dealing with a lot of stuff going on at home. So my apologies for kind of being away, but I hope you all are doing well. I hope you all have had a good week. I think it's been about a week um, since I was sick uh, and kind of coming back. So we've had some exciting news on the homestead. Um, we, ha we, we're, we hatched our first eggs from our little egg incubator. Um, so we have five little guineas that um, that are coming up and we're in the process of raising them along with a couple more uh, Egg layers we got so I think our total egg chicken count on our property is like somewhere around 50 something um, So it's a lot of chickens for someone who never had animals before but you know I hope you all are doing well. We're all getting ready to have somebody come out and, and uh, do an estimate and take down a tree that's like four feet from our house. Um, so we're about to have somebody come out and uh, cut it down, because Lord knows we need it, because it's a big limb came off from a storm and almost took out the new gutters we put on. That would've been awful. But, you know, I, I this last week has been a whirlwind. Uh, you know, it, it's, it's a lot of stress and a lot of pushing through uh, with a lot of great news as well. I mean, that's kind of, how life should be, um, but in my opinion, we kind of have a neutered viewpoint on life, where life is supposed to be this livial moving up, and while I believe the goal of life should be to constantly move forward, your emotional state doesn't stay in one state. If it does, I believe you to get yourself checked out, because, you know, we've had a lot of stress at the house, we've had a lot of blessings, we've had a lot of challenges, we've had a lot of, of everything, uh, and that's the homestead life, you get a little bit of everything. Um, but that's the blessing of the life. It's a full life as opposed to just a cheap life. Me and Gage went to the breakout room last night in Louisville. I took him for a little, you know, uh, man time. And, uh, we didn't make it out because we can't do math. I didn't know there was going to be so much math in there and it wasn't good. So if you do breakout, be prepared to do math because, uh, we struggled greatly with the math. But, um... You all have a great day. Joseph Simon, Bumbling Acres. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and have a blessed weekend. Bye.